Ow, ow, your ankle or something. Good morning guys, happy Vlogmas day seven. I woke up at around nine and I've been editing my lookbook that's gonna go up in a few days. I leave for school in about an hour and a half. Today's gonna be a really easy day at school. It's a shorter day for me. Well, I leave a little bit earlier, but I, I don't, I beat the traffic so I get home a lot earlier than I do on Tuesdays and Thursdays. So I'll be able to do everything I need to do when I get home, um, hopefully I can finish this before I go though and then export it and at least get that out of the way. Um, and then when I get home, I have to do the rest or some of my final. I'm gonna do two more questions on my final today. They're all essay questions. That's why there's only five questions total. Then I'm gonna edit and upload a horror video because it's been a minute then since I posted on my horror channel. So I'm glad I filmed that review yesterday. That makes me very relieved that I have something going up on my horror channel because I feel bad. Look at that face. Gamble. Come here. What are you doing? What do I wear today? What do I wear? Look at how messed up my closet is. I just have so many different hangers and shit in here. Uh, so Banty, Banty or Banty, what do I wear? Slayer, should I do Slayer and Mustard? Because I do that every day. Someone's coming. I hear him. Man, okay, first of all, it's raining. Got out of class early. Water on my glasses. It's like the worst part of wearing glasses in, in the rain. So we actually watched a movie in class and it was a movie I'd never seen. It's precious, which, I mean, obviously I've heard of the movie. I just had never seen it. And oh my gosh, first of all, it like really tied into the whole class, like, cause it was child and family psychopathology. And so we talked a lot about being a social worker and like school counselor and what you'd have to deal with. and. It was very emotional. Like, it was so sad. Great movie, though. Absolutely loved it. Gabrielle Sidibe is amazing. I guess I should listen to a podcast. Like, this is the perfect weather for a horror podcast. That's what I'm going to do. And then I need to go home and do some more homework. It's fun. But that was my last Wednesday class, so I'm not coming to school Wednesdays anymore. So, one class down. I just got the final on Monday for this one. And then we'll be good. All right, we got my Amazon package. What are you guys doing? Um, so I thought I would do a little haul. I don't know what came in this order and what's coming in the next order because they shipped separately. So I don't really, oh my God, my bullet journal! You guys, my bullet journal came, I'm so excited. It's a small one, so I don't know how much I'm gonna be able to put into it. Probably not a whole year, that's for sure. But since I'm not in school, I won't need to write down too many things. There's girl. Uh, this is JM's ring light that he had me order him. And with the bullet journal, I decided to get some pens. So I went with the Micron uh, pens. They're all in black. I don't really like the colored bullet journal thing. I mean, it's not for me. I don't mind it if, you know, if other people do it. Um, in three different sizes. So hopefully one of these sizes um, I will like, and then I can order more of those. But I thought I'd get official with a pens and bullet journals. And then I got another deodorant. This is my favorite deodorant of life. Let me get it out. The Schmitz Bergamot and Lime. Um, it does work for my, I mean, it doesn't work for sweating, but it's the only cruelty-free one I've found so far that works for like controlling odor with my sweating problem because other ones just do nothing. Like it's like nothing. Um, but this scent in particular works and I've been using their like rub-on, I don't even know what you want to call it. It's like in a little jar and you like scoop it out with the spatula and warm it up and rub it on basically, which might be weird to some people, but hey, you do what you got to do. You get a lot more product that way, less packaging, um, but I get lazy sometimes. So I wanted to get their like roll on deodorant. So yeah, and then I'm very excited about the <laughs> these. Oh my God. So JM texted me and he's like, I'm gonna get sorbet from work. We're gonna get some cheap champagne and we're gonna have a girl's night. And I was like, okay, Simple Life order's coming. So this is what we're gonna do tonight. And you'll see that in our little cocktails that we're gonna make. This is so funny, oh my gosh. Season three is shipping separately and season two was out of stock. So this is what we got so far. Do you guys know how hard it is going to be to not, oh my gosh, it's so gloomy. I don't know if you can tell outside, it looks so foggy like in the others or something, it's weird. It's gonna be so hard not to 
want to write in this right now. Like I want to start making my bullet journal for January, which I guess I could start filming that right now, actually, and just film it and then be able to upload it. Oh my God, this is so cute. So that's dotted pages on the inside instead of lines, which I like more. I got to learn to write small. This is a lot smaller than I thought it was going to be. They had a bigger size, but I really wanted something flexible that I can just have in my backpack that's like small enough to put in a backpack. So I'm really excited. This is like perfect. It was like $8, which I'll obviously need multiples. Um, but we'll see if I'll buy this brand again. I mean, it seems good so far. I don't know if like the pages will bleed. They seem pretty thick actually. So I don't think the pens will bleed. I do want to test out these pens though. I want to see what, what the hype is about with these like ballpoint like fine pens. These I can start using right away. 0.45, which is the biggest one. Ooh, oh, that's a good line. The 0.45 is definitely what I'm used to. I have most of my pens are this size. This is the 0.25. I wanna do the smallest last, so let's do 0.35. Oh, okay. I might wanna use the 0.25 in that new bullet journal, to be honest. I don't mean for this video to become all about bullet journaling, but you guys really should start uh, once you see my video. Oh, pff. this is a good pen. <laughs> Guys, I need to write on something. I mean, my handwriting shit, so don't judge me on that. That's another thing, another reason why I wanna do bullet journal videos because I see so many people and their handwriting is just so good. And I'm just not like that. I just scribble, chicken scratch, left hand, troubles, you know what I'm talking about with the whole ink stain thing on your hand. It's like smooth. This pen, is so easy to write small with, the 0.25. So I think I'm gonna use the 0.25 in my new bullet journal. The other thing that I ordered from Amazon is like a ring tray um, to like store your rings and it has like a glass lid and it just looks really nice. Um, I like how I just have my knife out. So I'm ex really excited to get that. I was hoping it would be in this order, but I think that shipped separately. So now I'm gonna make some food. I just got home obviously and um, make some food and watch a show before I get started on my schoolwork that I'm gonna that I have planned for today and before I pick up Jam because I want to get the schoolwork done before I pick him up so we can just have our girls night and have fun watching The Simple Life. I bet you will finish a whole season tonight. I'm not even kidding. We will. I am so drained mentally. Like I feel like I haven't even done that much or been that productive. Sorry, my hair. I took my beading off so my hair is just all over the place. I edited a video. I like went back and forth between doing my final and editing the video. I only got one question done on the final, but it took me forever to do it. And I don't know why, cause the other one didn't take me that long. And like the midterm didn't take me that long. So I don't even know. I just feel like I'm, I'm mentally drained today. So I only did one question and I don't think I'm gonna do another one, which I wanted to do two today. So I only had to do two tomorrow, two questions tomorrow but it's not due until Friday at noon. So I think I'm gonna do one of them Friday morning if I don't do all three tomorrow. Um, but I should be able to do all three tomorrow. It's the only thing I have going on until I have to do my final on Monday. And then I'm not starting my essay until Sunday because I need to give myself a couple days to like recoup before finals week. Um, otherwise I'm just gonna like lose it. Yeah, I'm tired of complaining about finals to you guys though. I don't think you guys care that much. Um, so hopefully I'll tone it down a little bit after today. But I just finished editing my horror review. I reviewed We Are What We Are um, rendering right now. It's almost done. I'm about to export it and upload that. And then I'm going to make some more food. Didn't I just make food? Not that long ago. But it's 7.30 p.m. And like I usually end the vlogs by like 8 at the latest so I can edit it and upload it. But I'm not going to end it yet because I pick up jam at 9. So today, oh, sorry, sorry, sorry. Today will be a late vlog and I apologize for that. But um, hopefully you can still watch it. What? Why are you on my bullet journal? Why are you just sitting on my bullet journal? I decided to make a snack because I don't have a lot of groceries, but I had chickpeas and this is like two cans worth of chickpeas. So I made a big old batch so I can have it for the next couple days. I just really wanted like a warm snack and I know it's not gonna be warm like later, but it just feels so good right now. And I'm leaving the oven open. Nate, that's hot. As I'm like, it's dangerous to leave the oven open, but I do it anyway. Cause then we don't have to turn on the heater, at least downstairs, it warms the kitchen area. Yeah, I'm gonna go enjoy this and watch some Top Model before I have to uh, pick JM up from work. Also wanted to update you guys on the uh, So Delicious Dairy-Free Coconut Milk 
holiday nog, eggnog basically. They call it holiday nog because there's no eggs in it, obviously. But it is a vegan eggnog and honestly, guys, I cannot taste the difference. It tastes so good. I, um, I don't think I tried the almond milk one because Jam has that right now, but I don't think I tried it yet. But coconut milk's my favorite, so I always get the coconut milk anything. But highly recommend vegan eggnog because it is so good. It's so much better for you than <laughs> regular eggnog. Even though I like regular eggnog, it's just really bad for you. Kidding, they like a long vlog, don't you guys? Saying my vlogs are too long. You tell me. I was watching one at work and then I just kept fast forwarding just like every like, two <laughs> well, seconds I talk a, a lot. clip of you just in the room. Talking. Well, yeah, I talk to them. That's what vlogs are, I talk to you guys. We're here getting our cheap champagne, probably Andre. We like a good yeah. Andre. Yeah, it's a brute. We like this one, the pink Moscato. Mm. That's it, just ones. Dude. He's a stripper on the Someone side. tipped us. All right, oh God. Fuck, it hurts. The foil's like scratching Oh. All right, don't mind the background. It's really ugly Ooh, from opening girl. the- Oops. <laughs> and the sorbet is melty. We're gonna put the sorbet. Squeaky, 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 squeaky. Stop it. <laughs> Is Mango. No. <laughs> oh. Strawberry. This will be cuter in the future. Yeah, when we have like. When the sorbet hasn't been sitting out because this was like 30 minutes before I got to home. Mm -hmm. It's basically like a root beer float for adults. Heck yeah. Although you can actually make like hard root beer floats. So True. That's technically an that's adult. That's really good float. too. So this is actually not what I just said it is. You Still know. a different kind of float. And you don't have to like mix it with anything. This is really good for like people that don't want to drink champagne on the rocks mm -hmm. because they feel like it's going to be too strong for them. Yeah. Girl, oh, don't, oh, don't, oh, don't, oh. don't. <laughs> Guess who, bitch? Me. But you're more Nicole, let's be real. No, yeah. Oh, I think they're just competitive. I don't know what's happening. I've never seen this season. All right, guys, I'm gonna end the vlog right here because we're getting too wrapped up in the show. It's 10.39 right now, so I have no idea when this vlog is even gonna go up. I hate, I hate you. He chugged his drink. Probably I didn't chug it for like 20 minutes. True. I still got some in mine. Divorce him. Anyway, guys, hope you enjoyed it. I'll talk to you tomorrow.